I'm going to have to go that way or that way. I might go that way. We're in the Cobb and Co Museum. Pretty amazing. There's so much of it. This is just the first room. There's a second room over there. This is pretty awesome. So this first section over here is all about the wool industry. And the people of the land. Throw this gear. Here is all about the Surat Basin. So they get ironstone, sandstone, coal, fossils, creatures that live there. So there's the dinosaurs that used to live in this area. The Artesian boar, petrified wood. And this is the best local. Yes, and this is the best local. And this is the best local. And the sea. Section of the eastern part of the Great Artesian Basin. This Coppin Co carriage is pretty impressive. Rather large. Might have to zoom the zoom the car. I can't zoom any further. <laughs> so rather large. Um, taller than my van. <laughs> the wheels, especially this back one, it's almost as tall as me. So let's have a quick look around the Cobb and Co Park. So for any of you history buffs out there, this was the final stopping point for the Cobb and Co um, carriages. Their last run went from Surat to Eubla. 
So uh, this is a nice little park area that they've actually done to commemorate that. It's the last Cobb and Co stop. I'll check that, but that's what they're famous for. But uh, you'd think they would have stopped in the middle of Brisbane somewhere, but I don't know. Let's go and read what it says over here. I'll videotape this, but I'll also take some pictures so we can read it better. Mail service number 177, Ubla to Surat, St. George. 127 miles, 203 kilometers. So it's, yeah. There you go. And that's the, the carriage that used to do it, which is the one I've got from visiting Surat. I've got pictures of that. Coach fares. This is really interesting. I will take some pictures of this, of the information, and add it on the end of this video. There's nothing in my way There's nothing in my way